The Common Platform Enumeration, or CPE, is a structured naming scheme for IT systems, software, and packages. CPE may be used for uniquely determining a specific version of a software. An example of a common CPE string may look like this. This is a CPE string for version 16, release candidate 1, of the React framework. A CPE string consists of several fields. The CPE version, with the latest being 2.3. The part, which is either application, operating system, or hardware device. The vendor, the product, the version, and other less commonly used fields. CPEs are commonly used together with vulnerabilities. For example, the following vulnerability affects multiple versions of Nginx. Close to the bottom of the page, we find known affected software configurations. If we expand the list, we see the CP strings of all software exposed to this vulnerability. Sometimes you're only vulnerable if you use a certain configuration of software and hardware. Let us use the Heartbleed bug as an example. Here we see the different configurations where the vulnerability applies. In configuration 1, you are vulnerable if you use any of the listed versions of OpenSSL. In configuration 8, you are vulnerable if you use any of the listed operating systems along with the specified hardware. CPE provides an easy way to check if you're vulnerable by comparing the listed CPEs with your own configurations.